Okay. Go. Hello. Aloha. It's Friday, and holy, I feel like I've been hit by a truck, but it's here to do mom truths, you know, to keep it consistent. Because we do mom truths on Fridays? Yeah, confessions. It was a big one last week. It's a lot of you. That was last Friday. That was last Friday. So, I mean, here's my truth for the week. Uh, we sat in a room full of women last night who were mothers, who often worked full-time jobs and had startup jobs on the side and were trying to start their own businesses. And the amount they were all juggling, it kind of hit me. I, I just, I don't get why um, we're not more celebrated. <laughs> Right? I can't really. believe how much some women can handle on top of being like, you know, and most good. often and most often be the one that has to take care of like the children in the house and go to work and have the job and manage the relationship and look good and have clothes on. Oh, clothes on? Why is that, is that a tough one? <laughs> yeah, like get you, they look good. Oh, they all did look good too. Yeah. Like they looked great, like not frazzled, not they hassled. They probably don't sleep. I don't know. It was just, it's actually mind blowing to me. Women are really good at multitasking, I guess. And you know, I just, um, I, this is no, no slap to the man, but I wonder um, if they could juggle as much, much as we do. No? No way. I just, if, like, the, we often talk about that, um, even full time working moms have to do all the signing of the sheets, all the parent teacher interviews, all the follow up of the after four programs, all the registration for sports, find the babysitters for the weekends. It goes on. Do all the parenting stuff. It's just, it's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy. I like to say it like I was like, it sounds cheesy, but it was a beautiful thing. Like, what was your struggle this week? Well, everything's perfect in my life, so. Oh, well, so she's so sick and couldn't stop. Moms don't have sick days. That's kind of a confession that sucks. Yeah, and nobody feels sorry for you, right? I was like, to my kids, I was like, guys, I don't feel well. Can you just please just bear with me here? No. They don't give a rat. No, they don't You care. don't feel well. Don't care. They're I'm literally, like, oh. you're like gonna die. You're like, so, I'm like sweating and then shivering and sweating and shivering and they're like, mom, I need another glass of water. And no one calls to see how you're feeling. Mm -hmm. No, it's just you, well. You and me, babe. No, and you know, like, you can't call, like, in our business, too, you can't call in sick, right? It's like... Moms can't call in sick, period. No, and we got to be there. Like, every opportunity, we cannot miss. Like, no. we don't reschedule a meeting because we don't feel well. Yeah. We just put our game face on and go. Do it. This is our chance. This is our opportunity. Don't miss it because you're sick. And, you know, this isn't about complaining. This is just about realizing factually that there are tough things about being a mom and someone said to me yesterday I like when you guys talk about not everything perfect right because a lot of people if you're going through it we're probably going through it so it's more about just keeping it real and you know what goes on in the back of my head like the oh, soundtrack so me. often go. so often this is go. this is since I had my first but like what doesn't kill you makes you stronger like it just keeps replaying in the back Do you know of what's head. in my soundtrack mm. story of my life one direction I don't know why it's <laughs> so happy it's, it's a good one. I know, but like, you know, it's just like, it's like every time when you feel like you're in a break. You do break out and sing that. Make you strong. There you go. So that's Friday, guys. We I know we owe you a recap of our event, but we want to bring you tangible tips to share so you can take them um, from what we learned. All coming. Um, that's it. Have a great weekend.